Okay, a short video. Um, I was going to do this right after work, but for some reason my um, recording program wasn't working right. So, anyway, here goes. This is going to be a short video about my stance on an issue that really irritates me a lot. And that's because, number one, I've been subjected to it. And number two, I see no place for it. But yet some people still insist on pinning this label on me, even though they don't even give a second thought to listening to um, my personal views about it. And they automatically pull the race card. Um, to qualify that, there is no excuse for anyone who is wronged by a person of one ethnicity, doesn't matter which one it is, to transfer that blame to their entire ethnicity. That's completely wrong. I don't care who did it or who was the victim. It's wrong. Point blank. Simple. Now the reason why some people have called me by this label of racist is because I don't choose to ignore the truth. Just because somebody has a certain ethnicity does not make them immune from guilt if they commit a crime. Whether that's a low crime or a high crime. Just because they are in a group or ethnicity that is supposedly has immunity from any kind of criticism does not mean they can avoid punishment for their actions. That goes for anybody. So, if you see anything on this channel that you might take personally because it seems seems to target your ethnicity it's not intended to just because a criminal shares your ethnicity does not make them you therefore it is not directed at you please understand this it's very simple it's not a hard concept to understand to comprehend not at all. I mean, it's very simple. A criminal is a criminal. It doesn't matter what color their skin, what kind of culture they have, what their background is, whether or not they seem to be okay, you know, or whether or not they're popular. A criminal is a criminal is a criminal. And if they circumvent or bypass or sneak around or ignore the rule of law then there are societal consequences for that it's very simple I've voiced very strong opinions about um, things such as Trayvon Martin I think it was wrong that he was murdered because he didn't get a chance to tell his story he didn't get his day in court he was shot supposedly in self-defense by a man who could have probably overpowered him pretty easily. I mean, you know, and that's another issue. But um, You know, people have tried to equate me with Hitler because some of the views that I have on certain historical events. And I'm not going to get into that in this video because it's a separate issue. But um, I think Hitler was a monster. He deserved every bit of what he got. He was irresponsible for transferring blame of criminals of that day 
to an entire ethnicity. And even more guilty because he not only targeted that ethnicity, but he targeted anybody who was an undesirable. That's despicable. There's no excuse for it. And anybody that does the same thing is just as guilty. Anybody who stood by and watched is just as guilty. Anybody who financed that government is just as guilty. Anybody who manipulated events so that that came about is just as guilty. Any government that does that today that carries out the same policies or similar policies of punishing an ethnicity for the crimes of people who dwell within that ethnicity is guilty of the same kind of a crime. When a criminal goes to court, rule of law states that you're not supposed to punish their family for their crime. Now, if members of their family committed their own individual crimes, they are tried and convicted on their own individual crimes. They are not tried and convicted for the crimes of their relative. Or it shouldn't be that way. I know society says different. We have a bad habit of jumping on a bandwagon and demonizing entire ethnic groups for the crime of one person that just happens to share their ethnicity or nationality. That is wrong. Not only constitutionally, but ethically. So that's where I stand on that issue. And people can call me racist all they want. But they're ignoring the point. Okay? Rule of law is rule of law. That's all I'm saying. You cannot apply the guilty verdict for a crime on an ethnicity because you will end up killing millions of innocent people just because of that. Anyway, that's all I have to say about it. <clears throat> I hope that some people are willing to watch this video all the way through and really take it to heart, let it soak in and really comprehend what I'm saying because you know it, it, it's over complicated in some respects and then again it's oversimplified in other respects okay it's oversimplified when it should not be and then it's confused and complicated when it should not be all right I'm out of here so until next time Pache, Shalom, Salam, Shanti, Shlama, Pungwa, Ewa, and Hupie. That's peace to all of you, and I hope we truly do see it in our lifetime. Thank you.